Welcome back, Room 10 families, to another story time with Miss Riorta. Today I'll be sharing the book, Steam Train, Dream Train. Now this story is special to me because when my son was little, he used to love trains. He could sit by the train tracks for hours and just watch different trains go by. He loved just sitting there with my father-in-law, his grandpa, and they would listen for the train sounds and he was so good that he can hear the honk or the horn of a train and he knew what kind of train it was. That's how much he loved trains. <laughs> Steam Train, Dream Train by Sherry Dusky Rinker and Tom Lichtenhelm. Steam Train, Dream Train. Steam Train, Dream Train. Through the darkness, clickety clock, coming closer down the track. Hold your breath so you can hear huffing, chuffing, drawing near. A whistle blares out in the night, a mighty engine, wondrous sight. The smokestack puffs, the big wheels grind, the trusty tenders close behind. Cling, clang, the bell rings out on top, hissing steam, brakes squeal, then stop. The driver signals to the crew, each worker knows what to do. Quick, before it gets too late, start to load up all the freight. Everything will soon be stowed, a train car matched to every load. The crew slides back the boxcar doors and tumbles in to start their chores. They whirl, twirl, cartwheel, jump, but cargo stowed without a bump. Things that rock and roll and spin all are juggled safely in. The freight is loaded as they play. They work and bounce the night away. Building blocks, erector sets, bikes and kites and model jets. The box cars made to safely haul almost anything at all. The hopper's top is open wide, so cargo can be poured inside. The crew hops to it, one and all. They get to work and have a ball. Then with a bounce, a pounce, a leap, three boys jump in and fall asleep. Tankers lined up in a row and getting filled with paints to go. Purple, yellow, green, and blue, a color convoy coming through. The reefer car is snug and cold. Its chilly box can safely hold frozen treats for every stop, like a rolling ice cream shop. The train car's packed, the crew sits back, and chills out with a midnight snack. Ten hard workers lend a hand to fill the gondolas with sand. Sand for castle, moats, and more. Sand for tunnels, sand galore. Stacked up on the auto rack, six race cars for a private track. Rainbow colors, flames, and stripes. Shiny engines, chromy pipes. The auto track will gently keep these fast, fast cars all fast asleep. The well cars carry giant beasts, munching on enormous feasts. Brachiosaurus likes the view, while T-Rex gets a bone to chew. The flatbed 
cars are rolling beds. The weary crew can rest their heads and settle in and tuck in tight. Their work is finished for the night. The red caboose is last in line. From the lookout, all looks fine. The freight and crew are tucked away. The next stop is another day. A hiss, a jolt, a shift and sway. Now the journey's underway. The train's departing car by car. The headlight fades into the stars, puffing, chuffing, out of sight. Steam train, dream train. Shh. Good night. The end. Have a good Sunday, Room 10 families. See you soon.